so I'm out with Martin Wood, the detective today, on one of his permissions. Um, so he's babysitting, so she's not out with me. So hopefully we can take some goodies back to have a quick scrub and a clean. So we have a big stubble field that goes on forever. Um, I'll give you a little look at that. Got to be a bit careful with the location on this one. So that's the field we've got. Goes on for miles and miles and miles and miles. Martin's had tokens out of it before, Romans, Amads. It's just down there, look. So let's hope we have a good day. So we're going to do a few live digs today. Um, this is a little bit more relaxed than on a club dig. So we've got a signal here. Hear that? It's quite loud. It's 86. See what we've got. Easy digging. Out somewhere there. So it's just a little bit of lead. A good banging signal. So I've just had this on a big old big old signal. Um, it's a piece of lead. If you look at it like that, if you looked at it like that, you'd think it was a spindle wheel. So whether it's come out of spindle wheel mode, a mould or something, don't know. So it could, could have come out of spindle wheel mould, I'm unsure. Weird old thing. So I've just had this. You can probably hear that, it's about a 64. Um, I think it's scuffling. So it's got the oval shape, so it looks like it's had a link there. Uh, there's nothing on it though, sadly. Shame it's not a silver one, but there's still time. So I'm going to call that one a cuff link. So I've just had this one, real screamer. Um, I thought it was a button because it's got that blob in there um, and it's got a blob on that side, but you can physically see the bus around it there, so it is a coin of some description. It's like it's been painted or something weird like that. So I don't know. But here's a coin, you can see the face. I don't know who it is. Just had this one, coming about a 58. Different tone as you can hear. Uh, normally buttons and things around there. But clean it off, and we've got a little Roman. See his face there, pointing that way. So a little Roman, I'll put a picture of that one up in a minute. You can see bits of writing, and you can see his face that way. So I've got one down here. Um, dug a piece of iron out of this hole, went back over it, better signal. Max this. About 70. Oh, it's only a silver Roman in it. Brilliant. Silver Roman. Woohoo. Get in. Look at that. Beautiful. About 20 foot away from the other one. So, just a signal. I'll say get used to um, a bit scratchy, but that was like a it's like a doorknob thing. So, so I've just had this. This was really low, about a forty. I don't know if you can see that, but on that side, it's um, Queen Victoria, and on that side, you've got the horse. And a date there and what I think it is is it's sovereign and it's a toy money thing but I think that's what it is it's quite a nice find actually so like the back of a sovereign would be on that side look the horse the line and the date and on that side um, Vicky Bunhead So 
just flick this one out. You can see it there in the clod, look. Quite a nice sound, about a 72. There's the imprint. Um, it's gonna be a little farthing. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say Vicky it is. They always feel nicer. So a little Queen Victoria bunhead farthing. There's the Tanya. Should be able to get a date off for that when I've got my glasses on. Just sort of nice, decent signal down there. Really high, nobody would miss it. I've not cleaned it off yet. By the shape of it and feel of it, I'm going to say it's another Roman. Yeah, it's definitely Roman. You can see the bust on it there. Let's give it a little wipe. Yeah, I'd say Roman. You can just see something on it somewhere there. Um, I'll try and clean it up a bit when I get back and put some pictures on. But yeah, we're definitely on the Romans now. I think there's nothing on that side that I can see. I think actually there might be. Might be there. The big Roman. So Martin's calling pit token on this because I can't find one for toffee today. Jinxed me, have you? I am coming. You jinxed me now. No pressure. The pit token king. I only said it was a pit token to wind you up. It's a bit of crap. Ah, you see. Oh, jinxed me. Done you? Oh, actually. Now, yeah, a bit of crap. <laughs> so, really on for the hunt for uh, pit tokens now. Big old 90. Uh, it's going to be an old George coin look. You just see his, uh, he's pointing that way. So I think that's, is that George II? Uh, I'll type it above anyway. But another coin, we don't mind that. Listen at this one. How can that be a button? Just had a little mount or something like that. Little diamond thing. Quite a low signal, I thought it was going to be a button. So, little mount. So, just had this one, this is quite a nice signal. And it's uh, quite a lovely old buckle. It's quite an old buckle, that one. Still not got that pit token. So when you see the Divid Detectorist video, he's making he's taking the mick out of me quite a bit on it. Nothing. It's not over yet, it's not over yet. So buckle. Um little coin. Can't really tell what's on it. Like just see Britannia on that side. So it's gonna be a farthing. Uh, this size is a little bit toasty. If we get anything off it, then I'll put a picture up on it in a bit. But it's another coin on the way back to the car. Still not had a pit token. I wish I'm going to get ribbed about all day, I think. But I've had Roman silver, other coins, bits and bobs. So it's been a good day, really. Car's there. It's a lead wheel, it's really old lead. So. Whether it's a votive wheel or not, I'm not sure. But which is a really old one. Got colour of lead, it's really, really white. So, quite a nice find. I'm not sure about it. I'll have to look into that one a bit better. 